Barry Sterling of ParamountSports.com. Today I'm going to break down what should be a great game. It's a game between the Oregon Ducks at home, laying 13 and a half points against the Washington Huskies. And if Oregon continues to win, possible national championship implications. Now, before we break down and predict this game, let me let you know what's going on at Paramount Sports. Well, another winning week last weekend. We go 7-1-2 and two on Saturday and Sunday. We won Maction on Tuesday night, 8-1-2 and two since we talked to you last. So things are rolling here at Paramount Sports. 11 out of 13 winning weeks. You want to get involved. Three different options for you. Just Saturday, seven games, $77. Sunday, five games, $55. We've not had a losing Sunday. That's right. Not one losing Sunday this entire year. Or you want to get our phone service from now through November 30th. Don't call it November. We call it November. This is our best bet. This is much cheaper than any other option. $197 for three weeks. ParamountSports.com or call 800-400-9741. Now, on to this game on Saturday where the Oregon Ducks are at home at Austin Stadium versus the Washington Huskies. Big rivalry here. These two teams, no love lost. Now, Oregon's are clearly the better team. I mean, except for the Georgia game, they pretty much run through their schedule. But I think this game, sometimes it's not who's better. It's about matchups. And two things actually give Washington a puncher's chance. Their quarterback, Michael Penitz Jr. He is only second right now in total offense to North Carolina quarterback, Drake May. He has thrown for over 3,250 yards this year. He's on pace to throw for over 4,000 yards and already has 22 touchdown passes. He leads the number one, that's right, they have the number one pass offense in college football. What's Oregon's defense? What's their weakness? Number 117th ranked pass defense. So yeah, they've had the lead, teams have been throwing on them, but I think they can be had. So I think Washington can score points there. Also, even though Washington's defense isn't great, and Bo Nix has had an incredible year, they have a lot of team speed. And when you have speed, you can make things happen. Sacks, turnovers, and maybe limit Bo Nix running the football. So I think it's, like I said, a game of matchups. The Ducks are better, but it's the way that Washington plays and the type of talent that they have that gives them a chance. I think Oregon's going to win 42-34, but I'm taking the 13 and a half, maybe now 14 points in the Washington Huskies here. You want to get involved? Just one place, ParamountSports.com.